My name is Vicki Bensinger and I teach in-home culinary classes and today I'm going to show you how to make a chocolate covered pretzel basket. It's very simple to make and even your kids can help. You can fill them with candy, you can fill them with berries or whatever your heart's desire. So sit back and watch the video and I hope you enjoy making them. So the first thing I've done is I've lined a bowl with plastic wrap. I sprayed it with nonstick spray and then put plastic wrap around it. Next, I've got some water in a pot that's been simmering and I've put a, non a glass bowl on top and I'm pouring in a package of chocolate chips. We're going to go ahead and stir these chocolate chips until they're completely melted and, and fluid. Now my chocolate looks nice and fluid. I'm going to turn off the water, turn off the heat, and pick up my bowl. Be careful because it's hot. I'm going to wipe off the, going to wipe off the bottom here. You want to be sure not to get any of the moisture into your bowl. I'm going to wipe it off and then I'm going to take it over to my counter. Now that my chocolate is nice and fluid and creamy, I'm going to go ahead and stir it up a little more. Then I'm going to take a bag of pretzels. Make sure your hands are, your sleeves are rolled up. This is a 16 ounce bag. I'm just going to take about half of these pretzels, half a bag of these pretzels, and I'm going to start stirring these up with my spatula and trying to coat everything. This looks lined pretty well. I don't think that looks like I have more than enough. So now I'm going to go ahead and take my pretzels. Now of course my hands are going to get a little messy here. But I'm going to go ahead and line the inside here, the bottom, with pretzel sticks my chocolate pretzel sticks. We want to line it so everything is nice and covered so your bottom is going to be covered when you put things in it's not going to fall out. After I get my hands washed. And then I'm going to start by setting these up the side of my basket. Okay, so here we have it. I filled up my bowl with chocolate covered pretzels and now I'm going to go ahead and put it in the refrigerator for about an hour so that it'll have enough time to chill and set. So I'll see you back here in an hour. I had a little bit left over here so I thought I had this small little jar and I a uh, bowl. I went ahead and sprayed it and lined it and I thought I'd go ahead and and make just a little one here. It might be fun. If you need to, you can always break your sticks up a little bit. We'll see how this works. Now I got this little basket done and I'm going to go ahead and put this in the refrigerator as well. Now that our pretzel lined bowl has come out of the refrigerator, I need to take my plastic wrap Carefully lift it out like so. And then carefully remove the plastic, our plastic wrap. Oops, there's one. It fell out. That may happen. You may have one or two that might fall out like that.
I'm going to do this carefully because you don't want to have them all falling off. And there we have it. Here's our bowl. And I have a special treat here. Got some little eggs. Since Sunday is Easter, we can make this even more fun. How about lining these with some little robin eggs? Now you tell me, is that too cute or what? Now, I also want to show you, I had some leftovers. So I had a small glass jar, glass bowl, I don't know why I keep calling it a jar. And I went ahead and did the same thing with this. We'll take this out. Remember this release is really easy because I've gone ahead and sprayed the inside with non-stick spray. I'm going to take this off. Again, you may have one or two that fall off. I just have a little bowl right here, a little plate. Now I'm calling it a bowl and it's a plate. Okay. And this one I kind of made like that. And I have some more eggs. And I'm just going to, oops, that one has a side compartment. It must be a condominium <laughs> for the birds. to give um, to children or just to have on the table. You could even do it as like a, um, a plate, uh, not a place sitting, but like, um, uh, you know, to mark for where someone's supposed to sit. I just think these are too cute. Look at that. How fun would that be to have sitting out? So there you have it. We've got our chocolate pretzel baskets lined with eggs. You can also put can other kinds of candy in it. You can put strawberries, um, whatever you can think of. So enjoy. This is an easy project. It won't take you very long. And um, I hope you have fun with it. And remember, after you eat what's inside the basket, don't forget to eat the basket. <laughs>